This blue panel office video brings up an important topic that has gone ignored for too long in the American workplace. Please take careful notes. You hear about sexual harassment on TV, and it makes the headlines in newspapers. As an employee, what do you need to know about it? First, sexual harassment is against the law. And it's against your company's policy. So what is sexual harassment? Linda, you are doing a fine job here. Oh, well, thank you, Steve. But you know, you might try dressing a little sexier at work. I I'm sorry? I mean, we're talking about your job here. There may be physical harassment. Wow. You really tense today, Nancy. Ow! Bill! Sorry. You looked really tense. You know, I really don't like it when you do that. Can you please stop? I'll never stop, Nancy. Never. In some instances, the harassment may be verbal. Word around the offices, you've got a fat cock. Yes, I do. I've got a fat cock, too. Maybe we should rub our fat cocks together sometime. Maybe a little oil. Two fat cocks. Together. Oil. It might be visual harassment, such as derogatory posters, cartoons, or drawings. Sexual harassment is not always about sex. It may be the result of a power struggle between a manager and a subordinate. I could go for a power fuck right now. Change is slow, and what was acceptable in common behavior years ago can now be sexual harassment. It smells like vagina in here. Excuse me? It smells like fresh vagina in here. Are you talking about my vagina? Maybe. Everyone wants to be treated fairly and with respect. Treat your co-workers with the courtesy and respect that you want for yourself. It's your company's policy, and it's the law. Men, brace yourselves for the incoming horde of Captain Obvious comments.